Hey guys, this is iPod Magic Pro here, and I'm going to show you how to move multiple apps to another page at once just by simply making all your icons move and then tapping them kind of like on the edge of the app and then go to a different page and then press the home screen and you have now just moved multiple apps to a different page at once so guys let's get started hey the time of my life and i never feel this way before all right guys so before i get started already click that subscribe button up there nice big bold and yellow and that would be really cool because of course it has a purpose and that is to be updated with my videos but second of all this is my first video I've ever made on this channel because if you're one of my subscribers you already know what happened to my old channel some things bad happened and um, all that stuff so I made this new channel called iPod Magic Pro but going back to the video of course you want to get this tweak and pretty much this lets you if you hold your your um your apps until it goes into wiggle mode and then tap like the corner I tap the corner because that's where the checks appear and then you can just put wherever you want to put them uh, say I want to move them over here and there they are really really simple not that really hard and I guess that's all I can say <laughs> um, just like I said this is my first video on this channel so I'm gonna have to get used to it and then you wanna go of course you wanna be jailbroken you wanna go down here to Cydia just let Cydia load and it should be loading right about now yeah and it won't pop up like this Don't you don't have to worry about that it's just that I was doing a demo on this video and uh, some things didn't work out as, as like I planned so I gotta keep on redoing and redoing it just press cancel up there Ugh, man why could they make city more easier I got the new city up but like just when I search them but so now city has loaded and for iOS 3 users since this works on iOS 3 um, I recommend not doing what I'm, I'm gonna do right now because for iOS 4 users and render display users, I would get I would add the source that I'm about to add right now. But if you're on iOS 3, just skip through this video, and until you see me going down here to, to the search bar. But if you're on iOS 4 or have a render display device, you want to. Sorry guys, I, uh, I just had something in my throat. Um, go down here to manage, and uh, like I said, I was doing a demo, and go to sources. And if I'm going too fast, just stop stop the video and then keep on going. Go to top right, edit, and then add. And you want to add the source that is in the magic box below, aka description. And I made that up um, today. I was like, what can I call the description? I don't want to call it description. It's kind of boring. So I call it the magic box. So that will be right there. Okay. And it is called repo.insanelyi because this source is normally for people, uh, it's iOS 4 ready and run a display ready. It's pretty much the m most hacked repo you can get. So definitely add that source. And then once you once you gotten that source, you want to go down here to search. And now everyone's on the same page, iOS 3 users and iOS 4 users. Um, you want to type in on the search bar, multi then icon there's pretty much do this multi icon mover everything together even when there's two eyes between multi and icon there's two eyes forget about that just put multi icon mover and then you want to um for ios 4 users download the one by insanely i then ios 3 users get the one by big boss so install those packages and then once you're done you'll have to respring and then you don't you won't have anything in settings it'll just be integrated on your iDevice and that's pretty much it guys thank you for watching my first video so that's really great and comment below subscribe above put a thumbs up for the people that like this video and thumbs down for the haters peace out guys iPod Magic Pro is now out